Hi, my name is Sally, and I am the aunt of Isaac Guzman, who on December 3rd of 2004 was killed on Airport Boulevard. Isaac was a very loving, kind, good-hearted, very devoted to his family young man. He was a senior in high school wanting to pursue his education in becoming a construction worker like his father or even become a firefighter. Isaac was very close with his cousin Roxanne. He actually considered her as more of a sister. At the time, Roxanne had been living with her boyfriend Mario Lozano. There was rumors that Roxanne had been abused by Mario. Isaac heard these rumors and confronted Mario. Feelings were, were tense between them. Things were just kind of left unsaid. On December 3rd of 2004, Isaac had been waiting for his father to pick him up at a market right across the street on Airport Boulevard in Watsonville, California. It was after three in the afternoon, broad daylight. Mario Lozano had been waiting for Isaac to finish his day at school. Lozano confronted Isaac about what had been going on with Roxanne and the kind of attention they had towards each other. Their argument escalated into a fight. It seemed like Isaac did try to defend himself. It seemed like Mario then pulled out a knife. Mario just stabbed him over 30 something times. It seemed like Isaac just didn't have a chance. Isaac was airlifted to a local hospital. Shortly upon arrival, he did not make it. A lot of witnesses have reported that they did see Mario run, that he fled the scene. There was a warrant issued by the Watsonville Police Department for Mario Lozano's arrest. Mario's last known whereabouts could either be in Mexico, Arizona, Idaho, or even California. Mario Lozano is about five feet, eight inches tall. He was around 150 pounds. He has black hair and brown eyes. On his right side of his neck, he has a large tattoo that has the name Roxanne, as well as a birthmark. On his left hand, he has a tattoo on his wrist of four dots. There is a $20,000 reward leading to the arrest of Mario Lozano. If you have any information, call the Watsonville Police Department at 831-728-3544. And remember, you will remain anonymous. We as a family will never be the same without Isaac. He was a very beautiful, fun-loving young man, and we miss him terribly. Mario, if anyone close to you is listening to this, or even you are listening to this, we will not stop fighting for Isaac. We want you caught.